Hey folks, Middle of the Pack Runner Bill here. Today I'm going to do a review of the Skint Wallet. What is the Skint Wallet, you say? Well, it's one of the world's smallest wallets that you can actually get. Um, I bought this two weeks ago to go on my running camp trip, uh, three days in Thailand. And uh, I, bought, I bought it basically because I didn't really want to take my leather wallet with me and I wanted something that was really small and, and uh, that, you know, that I could take with me every day when I was running. Um, so I bought this and anyway, it's been great ever since. Uh, let's take a look at some of the details of this wallet. The skin wallet is black, but you can choose the color of the elastic band that you want to accentuate the wallet with. I of course chose orange. You open the wallet like this and the skin wallet is made of this very stretchy material throughout the whole wallet. It has two slots for cards with thumb holes in it. There's another pocket with a thumb hole on the outside along with two other pockets without thumb holes. Each of the pockets comes with a thin small plastic card. Now the job of this card is to actually keep the integrity of the wallet intact when you have no cards in it. It also aids in putting your cards in smoothly and taking them out as well. If you totally want to secure your card in the wallet, simply pull the stretchy material over the card like this. There's also a small loop in the wallet that you can use to hook your wallet up to something. For example, you can use a carabiner here, just like this. Lastly, the great thing about this wallet is you can put any kind of currency notes in here, um, no matter what the size is. Here I have 10 different currencies in here, and the last note here is the Thai bot, which is the biggest note of all of them, and it fits perfectly. Okay, so to compare, I put the skin wallet next to a standard wallet, like the one on your left, and uh, the one in the middle is basically a smaller wallet than the one on the left, which is the one I use every day, but of course it's not as small as the skin wallet. Next, I would like to compare what each of the wallets look like with 14 cards and 10 banknotes in it, okay? The first one, let's look at the standard wallet. Here, this is what it looks like, and basically the thickness is about 3.5 centimeters. Next, we have the smaller medium wallet, which is the one I use every day. I had to put the cash in where, where the cards go because uh, there's actually no dedicated uh, slot for your cash, okay? And therefore, it kind of hangs out a little bit, which is fine. Uh, I don't mind it too much uh, since it's only two centimeters thick. And finally, this is what the skin wallet looks like with 14 cards and 10 banknotes inside. It's nice and compact. As you open it up here, you can see that the cards are nice and packed in there. Um, the problem is it's about three centimeters thick, so it's a little bit too much if you just want something that's really small. To demonstrate how small the skin wallet is, I can actually fit it into my gel pocket of my running shorts. But that's crazy, right? Because they'll fall right out. But remember that carabiner loop that I told you about earlier? This actually makes it safe and secure enough to go running with, right in your gel pocket. Here are a few action shots of me using the Skint wallet. Well, I use that term loosely because how much action could there possibly be in paying for a bill at the restaurant? Having said that, the missus also likes the Skint wallet and here's her action shot. In conclusion, the Skint wallet is an excellent option if you don't want to carry a standard size wallet. I mean, you can put a lot of cards in here, it's nice and compact, and it still remains super light, okay? Now in our example, we used 14 cards and the thickness was about three centimeters, so that's a little bit too thick for me. Um, I like to take my six most important cards and cash and put it in. It's basically less than two centimeters thick, so that's perfect for me. Um, these days I use this every time I go on a hike or go to the gym, anytime I do, anytime I kind of do sports. So. Um, it's perfect for me when in those situations. Will it become my everyday wallet? Uh, you never know. It's possible because this is how much I like this thing, okay? So anyway, uh, as always, thanks for watching and have a great day.